Hi, this is Tudor Nick P, and this is Word Origins 222. Word origin today is chauffeur. Okay, somebody wants a screenshot, do it right now. All right, let's get right to it. Uh, now, remember, we get this word from French, so it has a French pronunciation, so the CH is pronounced more like an SH. And remember, a lot of times in French, we got an AU together, it's like O. So that's why we pronounce the beginning of the word as like cho, cho, chauffeur, chauffeur. All right, so let's continue. A chauffeur is a person that looks after the car and drives a rich or important person around. So that's his job to mind the car, like when the rich person leaves, but also to drive them around for wherever they need to go or wherever they have to go. Let's continue. The term chauffeur comes directly from French. That's why we pronounce it in a French way. It derives from the verb chauffeur, uh, you know, without the U, meaning to heat. The term chauffeur was created to turn the term into a noun. The original chauffeurs were people who had the job to stoke a steam engine and keep it running. Like, remember in the, the old locomotives that keep throwing the coal? If you stoke a fire or you stoke uh, an engine, you've got to keep that fire running. You've got to keep it hot. So you have to keep doing things to keep the heat going. So that's why they ended up being called a chauffeur. Thus, it really meant one who heats. All right, let's continue. In the early 1900s, when automobiles first appeared, the French extended the word to a person who drove a horseless carriage uh, and gradually developed into the person employed to drive other people around. So that's how we got chauffeur. That's where it came from. All right, and we got four examples to show just how we'll use it. Here's the first one. Uh, he employs several chauffeurs. Okay, you can say it that way. Uh, it is not easy to be a chauffeur of a stretch limousine. Yeah, well, we all know limousines, but the stretch limousine is that really, really long one that has like extra doors. That's a stretch limousine. It must be difficult to, you know, make turns and drive around with that one. All right, um, number three here. They hired a chauffeur to drive them around the city and show them the tourist sites. Yeah, well, if you got enough money, maybe you could do that. Number four, uh, he is a hired chauffeur, uh, but he is not required to wear a uniform. Yeah, you know, a lot of chauffeurs do naturally wear uniforms if they work for a certain company. Uh, or even a private one, sometimes they might want them to wear a uniform. But maybe a different individual boss may say, nah, it's okay, you don't have to. Okay, anyway, I hope you got it. I hope it was clear. I hope it was informative. Thank you for your time. Bye-bye.